Eberly, Paso Robles. Eberly Wine from Paso Robles. It's Zinfandel, Zinfandel, 2007. Right. Not only is it there, but we have 50% from the Steinbeck Vineyard and 50% from the Winebush Vineyard. So if you happen to know those vineyards, then this is what we got. Right, and we have, it's almost 16% alcohol by volume. Whoa. Yeah. So Pretty interesting. Spiking, it's $24. They make a lot of this, almost 3,000 cases. So... Pretty standard Zin nose, in my oh, opinion. Oh, wow. I like this nose. You like, like this one, huh? It's got a little chocolate. It's, it's got... It's meaty. It's, I get blood. Like... That's more... Normally something you get more in Syrah, but I do get that a little bit. Oh, yeah. Like, <clears> this is like raw meat. That's like the overwhelming thing I get. I really like it. You don't also, get like a figgy, raisiny sort of thing going on? A little raisins. I can see raisins, but yeah. It's really... I like the nose a lot. Okay. Very complex I agree. It's me. a nice nose. And it feels heavy in the glass. Okay. Wow, this is a big wine. It's extremely um, viscous. It's 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 big bodied. Ah, it's, the it's, finish is nice. Exactly, it's a little light at the beginning, but mm. the finish is incredible. It's very strong mm. at the end. Yeah, that is a nice finish. That is really nice. That was my first sip. We have somebody wanting more. Actually, this is pretty good for twenty four bucks. Um, really good it, it for gets, twenty four bucks. You get more of the chocolatey. It actually gets a little. You get the more of the sweet notes on the finish, I think. It starts off like rare meat, mm -hmm. and then it actually sweetens up. Like you get a little like foie gras, sort of chocolatey sort of finish to it. I also think it would pair really well with a lot <clears> of <throat> um, gamey meats and a lot of mm. high like. This would go great with pizza. This would go great with everything. Go great. This is this is delicious. It's really good. The finish actually, is, this is really good. The more I drink it, the more I appreciate the finish on it. I'm just picking up so much from it. We just had a Zin that you guys didn't like that much, and I liked a lot, but I must admit, I like this significantly more. Like, this is a beautiful, this is, like, really nice. It hits you over the head a bit. It's not the most, like, subtle, um, nuanced wine. Right, but that's the type of style of Zinfandel I think I like. You know, a really right. a really big wine that's going to be a crowd pleaser. Yeah, yeah, I mean, this is what I expect out of Paso Robles. This is, this is This is really good. For 24 bucks, it's delivering a hell of a I'm, punch. I'm really enjoying this wine. I mean, this is, like, a 91, almost 92-point wine. I for would say 92, bucks. 93. I it's, really like it. I'm really impressed with this. It's ridiculous value. And Eberly, I think, Eberly Zinfandel. Wow. If we're pronouncing it right, that is what it is. Um, we'll Sorry, have more coming it. coming from them uh, on future episodes of Wine Weirdos. Wow. And, looking forward to that. Yeah. Very cool. So cheers. All right.